Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and for those of you who are new, my name is Maggie and today's video hasn't happened in a long time. I think I stopped um, wearing makeup uh, right when pandemic hit and it's also because I was uh, really really sick at that time and then I don't want to do anything with makeup so I'm like eh. Anyways, what I'm gonna do today is I'm just gonna put a very very natural makeup because I am trying to get a passport photo uh, me and my cousin are planning to go to Canada and visit my aunt over there and also do some you know some videos as well for you guys to watch for the vlogging uh, without further ado let's go ahead and start <laughs> Um, I already did um, moisturize my face. Um, I'm using I'm using J Lo Beauty, by the way. And um, this is a <laughs> wow. This is not a paid ad, okay? But I really love her product. And uh, this is J Lo Beauty the Blockbuster. I also wash my face with um, her uh, facial wash, and I have the tightening and brightening. <laughs> this is a J Lo that j-lo glow yeah <laughs> don't even know that but anyways these are both really hella good um very creamy and it's just really good on my skin for foundation uh l'oreal um infallible up to 24 hour fresh wear um i've only used this just so little i'm gonna go ahead and start putting this on my thing I don't even remember if I put it like that. Okay, whatever. Let's go do that. You keep bouncing it on your face. There you go. Okay, it's not even my color. Hold <laughs> Because I got dark. <laughs> Let me take this off. <laughs> I got a little... I got not a little dark, but really... <laughs> really uh, tan, I would say. Because of the Hawaii and i like summer so oh my god how are we gonna fix this um okay <laughs> i don't like putting stuff on my neck uh okay let me see i got morphe over here <laughs> maybe this i got morphe f330 and i got morphe f360 maybe this okay let's try this <laughs> It's funny, going back to makeup is weird. Weird. Alright, alright, here you go. This is kind of okay. It's not that bad. Um, now I was wondering if... <laughs> if this Tarte shape is actually okay to, to use. Oh my god. Oh my god. We'll make it work whatever okay that's it. I just dabbed it I don't like too much um, and then you just do that I mean it's fine um, and then I will I don't know if I should set it but let's go ahead and do the the, the setting <laughs> powder loose face powder it's the air spun I really like it I just dab it with a like a flat brush um there you go i lost all my eyebrows from chemotherapy and unfortunately you can see it unfortunately it didn't come back so this is what i use see that it's a fourth tip and you can you can get this from amazon it's the eyebrow contouring and it's got the like the fork. Here you go. Uh, just like that. I just need a, just a little bit because I already have it. All right. So the good thing about this, it's waterproof. So even if I go swim uh, or get wet or whatever or sweat, it doesn't come off easily. So I'm just gonna get a flat, flat brush, okay, like this, flat brush. 
And I'm using a Fit Me Concealer by Maybelline. And I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna super put it. Just, I just need a little bit. Because, there you go. Like you tap, tap it. Um, there you go. Sometimes I just dab it like that to kind of let it sit. So you can see the difference. I'm going to dust off like the powder, the loose powder. So let me dust it off. Uh, I am, I don't know, I'm, I'm thinking if I should, I guess so. Oh my God, look what I did. <laughs> look what I did on that. It is showing. It's tracking my face. Okay, here. You see? Oh my God. What have I done? Oh my God. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I ruined it more. Oh no. <laughs> oh my gosh. I ruined it more. But I got another one that's so tiny. Tiny. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty. So... I think it looks pretty clean already. So I'm just gonna... Okay, here's the tricky part. Some people, they close their eyes. Um, okay, I'm trying not to close my eyes. See, it looks weird when you do that. Okay, there you go. This is not waterproof though. This is called the NYX, um, that's the point, eyeliner, <laughs> NYX, that's the point, eyeliner, because it's so tiny. Okay, I said it's simple, okay? Not glamorous. <laughs> and then I'm going to get, I think I'm ready to just kind of contour a little bit. So this is True Complexion Contour Palette. I've, had, I've been using this for years and I think it's pretty good. Um, and I'm just gonna use, you know, um, just a flat thingy for me. I tried using this though. Uh, I'm I don't know, I don't like it. I use whatever it is that I'm comfortable with. So whatever makes you feel comfortable, use it. All right, so I'm just gonna use this, the contour part of it, which is, come on, open. <laughs> which is this one, which is almost gone. Obviously, I haven't bought any recently. So just do that like that. And then just do that like that. And it's kind of like drawing a line. It's it's pretty cool. There's a lot of great artists, makeup artists. You can, you know, really change the shape of your face and whatnot. <laughs> you know, I like it more natural. Um, I like makeup, that's all. Um, and that's why I just want to share some. Because others may have a different tip. Others may have a different tip. But you may have something different, but then again, you cater it, you know, based on your shape of your face, the color of your skin, um, if it's tan, lighter, or, you know, during winter, I'll get lighter. So, so right now it's because we just came out from summer. So there you go. So I'm just going to put just light. Not being so snatchy. <laughs> there. And then whatever, you know, left over you have, you just do that unless you feel like it's not doing anything. I mean, there is a little bit, but I don't want to be like too much of it. Whatever it is that's left over will do. All right. Then you're going to grab, again, the... Um, 
the True Complexion Contour Palette. And this is for like this sculpt. But I use it for like um it's like a blush. <laughs> like a blush. So I just do this kind of to blend it. And I use a flat, uh, not a flat brush, it's e.l.f. Um, blush brush. And just kind of like doing this. Just kind of blend it in. Your skin. <laughs> Keep blending it! Okay, so I was able to blend it. Blend it. I have, okay, this is, this is a cool one, okay? None of you guys have this, unless you go to 99 cent store. <laughs> it's Space One Cosmetics. It's Jet Set Contour and Blush uh, Palette. Now, believe it or not, um, they're very pigmented. So when you have this, you better make sure that you don't kind of dip your brush hard. Just a little bit, like... Because you can see this. You see that? And I didn't even dip it that hard. So I just need some little blending going on over here. So can you see that? See? It's actually nice. It blended nicely. Very uh, subtle. So and then I did this again. Look. You see that? So you be very careful when you're using this one. This is jet... Uh, jet bleh. <laughs> Jet Set Contour and Blush Palette Phase 1 And that's that color So fortunately Doesn't have Because it's 99 cent store Hmm So I will buy brand names But I'm not a sucker for it So <laughs> If you guys have different brands for You know Use it As you wanted it but whatever works for your skin, just remember, every person is different for their skin, their makeup needs, and all that. And I'm not on the line like all the time, so. <laughs> all right, there you go. Mess that hair, mess that hair. My husband said, just keep messing your hair. I'm like, what are you talking about messing my hair? It's messy already. And it's, you see that? It's and then you do that, a little bit of that, so you have a, like others will say, oh, so your neck looks smaller <laughs> or thinner, like you're thin. There you go. So we did that. And I'm just going to kind of run this over here in the middle for the nosy. Yeah, I didn't really contour my nose that much. I'm just kind of like putting whatever leftover is on this brush. And then, of course, we're not going to miss this. This is very, very important. Again, guys, very important <laughs> to have. Okay, and this is called the Summer in Tropez. Did I say that right? With BH Cosmetics. And obviously, you'll see this. Obviously. Obviously, I love this color over here because it's the color of sky. See that? Nothing. However, let me do this. See that? That's a tiny piece of that over there. And I'm just gonna dab it over here. Oh! <laughs> okay. Make sure it's right. I said I'm gonna dab it, but it's like. Alright. Okay. Because my nail is long. And then we're just gonna blend it like that. I kind of miss this. There you go. There you go. Okay. Gone in my... <laughs> but it looks nice, doesn't it? Just just subtle. Because if you're going out to Walmart or Target, you know what I'm saying? You're not attending the Grammys. Subtle is good. I like a tiny brush like that. This doesn't have no brand name, so... Like I said, not a sucker of brands, but whatever it is that works for me, I'll take it. So... That's the Paradise color. So again, if you guys are interested, and I don't know if they still have this in, um, if they still have it on Ulta, but I got it on Ulta. It's BH Cosmetics Summer in Tropez. 
And the color that I use, and, that, and obviously that's the only color that I use. I love it. And these colors, the bold colors over here, but seldom, seldom. I just really want some natural look. Um, that's the paradise uh, color. And then I'm using the marina right on top of that paradise. And look, look at this, guys. Just look at this. It's very simple. Very subtle. But it makes a lot of difference when you kind of put it on the right spots. Let's put some lashes. All right, guys, I am using the Bella Lashes, okay? And I got the TikTok make, made me buy this. <laughs> and it's called Make, and it's really, really nice. Watch this. Um, I'm using I, I, I Lure. <laughs> Did I say that right? I Lure. I Lure, 18 hour lash glue, latex free. <laughs> so let me go ahead and put this on first and then we'll move on to the next step. Here you go. All right. I kind of like it. I haven't I haven't done this in a long time, like really long time. Anyway. Okay, so this is Morphe 350M. Yep. There you go. That's like more on the natural look or something. So Kind of more warm, warmer tones. So I'm just gonna go ahead and dive into this color first. Not too dark, but kind of like just to give a little bit. So I'm just gonna put it over there at the, like at the corner like that. Then I'm gonna, <laughs> this is another, this is the like a, Fluffy, fluffy brush. No, non -brand, brand. So, this is how it looks like. You see that? There you go. And I'm just gonna go grab something that's a little bit lighter. So, this is the first one that we use. I'm gonna go grab this. There. Just like, and then we're kind of like blending it. So, it's kind of much more. Um, what do you call that? Blended properly. Or kind of like blurred out. <laughs> That's what I mean to say, blurred out. And now we're down to the lip liner. So it's LA Girl Lip Liner GP512 Natural. So that's how it is. It's very um like like light, like warm again, you know. Like it gives accent to the like shadows to the the features you have. It's crazy. I'm going for Morphe again. Obviously, that's my I guess my favorite brand. I got a brand. <laughs> um, and I'm using the Fling. So Morphe lipstick, and it's the matte collection. It's called Fling. Fling. <laughs> so. It's very like, like very not natural, but it's not like super bright. There you go. It's not. It's not pain in the eyes. <laughs> this is like a more um, makeup but natural kind of look. Uh, subtle, I would say. Not like um, you know, hey, I have makeup on too much. Uh, you know, you can't read my face if I remove my makeup. I don't look the same. <laughs> I mean, who does when we remove our makeup? But it, but I just wanted to kind of like accent, you know, or highlight whatever it is that I need to highlight on my face, my face. Okay. So anyway, all right, guys. So here is the finish look. It's kind of like a more everyday kind of makeup for me. I didn't put, I didn't even put anything on my um, my eyelids because I wanted to make it look more natural. So it's just the the uh, eyeliner and the lashes. Uh, I didn't even put no lashes on the bottom and I just kind of like highlighted it a little bit more. And this is my passport photo look. <laughs> 
If you do like this video, please hit that like button and share it with your friends. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button down below so you'll be able to get notification once we post new videos. I really appreciate you spending your time with me and I do hope you have a good day. Bye!